Hello and welcome to a brand new episode of Instacar HK. Today is actually the Chinese New Year long weekend. So first of all, Kong Hei Fa Choi to all of you. Now since it's a long weekend and the weather is great, I thought why not I go to Sheko for a morning drive and I'll bring you guys along with me. So let's cross our fingers and hope that we'll see some nice classic and supercars at Sheko this morning. Now I'm going to take my beloved 1976 Alfa Romeo Junior to the morning drive. Now for those of you who have been following my account for long enough, you should know that I've owned this car for a number of years before selling it around two years ago. Last year it was for sale again and I missed it so much that I decided to buy it back despite the little accident that it had when I sold it. Now today it is back into its former glory again and you guys will see later how well it runs. Now, we'll actually have a dedicated video review of this car very soon. But for today, I'll just let you know, I've actually been you know, tuning up and fixing up this car in the past two months. Not so much because of a little accident that it had, because that was all aesthetics. But the problem was, I, I don't think the car was maintained very well in the last ownership. I don't think the garage they used was pretty good. Therefore, a lot of things I have to redo, and I'll go into detail in the review video. But today in particular, I'm very excited because I actually finally got my own garage to tune the engine again because the engine was running quite rough previously. And we realized that the um, carbs were not tuned well, they were completely out of whack, and the engine was also using the wrong spark plugs. So after my garage had a go with the engine, the car is running perfectly again and back to its former glory. So now, as always, even though I love to talk about how to start a carb car, in this car, now is again easy to start because the engine is running well now. So as always, you flip the key, there's a tick 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 noise, that's the fuel pump. You give it a fuel pump on the gas pedal and then you turn the key and at the same time continue pumping the pedal just like this. We're off. So let's go to Shaco now.
BM cars here. Of course, the Honda NSX. This is actually a manual version. Let's see. Got the wrong wheels though. These are NA2 wheels. I like this better. This Subaru Spec C RAR. This is of course the lightweight version of the version 9. It's even more special than the S204, especially with this little roof scoop. Special white wheels. Very cool pair of JDM we have here today. We have a first ever generation GT3. This is kitted out with sports seats and roll bars. The 964 Turbo here. Oh, I love these. Especially with these speed line speed line wheels of course it's going after the turbo six look which this one is not but definitely cool enough the best thing about these 964 turbos I look at the wide fenders just look at that beautiful here is one of my all-time dream cars, Lamborghini Murcielago, all opened up for us to enjoy. Yellow is also the best color for it, as far as I'm concerned. And we've got those perfect Roadster wheels. This is of course the first generation, it's not the LP640, nevertheless it's still a thing of beauty. These came in manuals as well. And the manuals are more common than you think. I mean, they're still rare. But ones for sale come up from time to time. This one is, however, an e-gear. One of the reasons I haven't ever bought one is because maintenance costs are prohibitively expensive on these V12 monsters. But damn, I would like to own one one day. Very nice. Check out this beautiful fixed head E-Type. I've just arrived, it's the first time I've ever seen this one. You can see it's the first series because of the headlight lamps and the small indicators. Beautiful Barani wheels. There's actually a 4.2, so it's not the earliest, as you might remember from my E-Type episode. The earlier ones are 3.8. But the fixed head's proportion is impressively just as beautiful as the open top. We hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please give us a like and subscribe and we'll have more videos coming soon. Thank you.